this match features Borussia Dortmund against J.M. Buk, Hyundai Motors. The visiting team have been undoubtedly the best defensive team in the division, but that defence will be put to the test here. It's a wonderful asset to have, isn't it, on the road, coming to a, a ground like this, and to know that you really have got a good defence. This is the Borussia Dortmund lineup. In goal, Roman Berkey. Sven Bender plays alongside Nevin Subotic in the heart of defence. Sebastian Roder starts with Steven Unzonzi in the centre of the pitch. And we'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. And for the away side, this is how they line up for this match. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the goalkeeper. Nathan Ake starts, looking to continue his good form at the back. Joshua Kimmich plays with Mohamed El Nenny in the centre of the pitch. In attack, Paolo Dybala partners together with Marcus Rashford. Whoever is the coach of Borussia Dortmund, the passion and the nature and the DNA of this uh, real working man's club is uh, it's special, it's very special indeed. Well, it's one of my favourite European grounds, you come here on a European night and it's just wonderful, that yellow wall behind the goal, it's a sight to see. Sebastian Rode. Well, they're in a good position here. the shot a oh, great work by the keeper it'll be a corner and he gives it back to it it's Kagawa now he's looking for support Eric Durham Moving the opposition around with their play, these two players. Schiller! Hit it well, but... Oh, just too high. Now Marcus Rashford. Our good friend Alan McAnally is watching the Tottenham game today at White Hart Lane. Alan? It's a goal for Tottenham Hotspur. It's been scored by Hung Min Son. The hard work was done for him, and he had a tap in. 11 minutes played, 1 0. Cheers, Alan. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. It's a good ball and shoots. What a fine save. It's going to be a corner. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. The goalkeeper comes out with a punch. Ginter. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looks very encouraging. Now Van Dijk. Mohamed El Nenny. Goal news now from Juventus. It's a goal. Flag has gone up for offside, tight. <laughs> Steven Unzonzi. Sebastian Rode. He's coming forward with some danger. the ball in <laughs> a 
couple of teammates who are clearly on the same wavelength. Comes in strongly. He's gone in strongly and got the ball. This could be a chance. Now the shot! He's kept it out. They've gone for a corner. Well, at first sight, Alan, I must say it didn't look like a goal. It's good to have the replay because that helps us if it's tighter, but that wasn't one of the tighter issues. No, I think we all knew it wasn't over, although one or two of the forwards were appealing with arms up, but that replay, that confirms it. Matthias Ginter. Ginter. They've got a great understanding, this team. Just look at the passing. Yuri Shaheen. We've got a suspension to deal with today, Alan, for the home team. Probably the first choice centre midfield player, and he's banned. Yeah, I mean, I suppose it was going to happen. He, he loves to put his foot in, but it, it is a chance for this lad coming in. Into the attacking third. Got the tackle in. It was nicely worked until that point when it broke down. And now they've got to try and regain possession. Nicely played through ball. Dybala. They are the league leaders, Alan, and they're playing like league leaders. Yeah, they are. They've got that, that swagger about them, haven't they, Martin? Um, produced some majestic stuff today. It's a tough ask for the visiting team today because the home side have won their last three matches. Well, and they're full of confidence, and with the home crowd behind them, I think it'll be tough for the visitors. A real error by the keeper. Came in with a challenge. Schiller! Try just too high. Mohamed El Neni. Three minutes to be added on. Probing away. Trying to find room for a shot, maybe. The shot's on! Great stop. Gone for goal in spectacular style. Wow. I was expecting him to be wheeling away in celebration there. And there is the half-time whistle. I think the coach will be considering his options on the bench. El Neni. On the attack here. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Really on... And shoots! Bender. Steven Nzonzi. Substitute is ready, I think, to come on for Dortmund. Plenty of action at White Hart Lane today in front of our man Alan McInally. It's a third goal for Tottenham Hotspur. It's been scored by Hung Min Son. Well, this is an opportunity. When you concede a free kick in an area like this, you could be in serious trouble. Tries to punch it away. Very good game here, a tight one. They're trying to get themselves into a position to take the lead. Now Van Dijk. That's a good report from Alan McAnally, but it had to be a brief one. Uh, he has told us that Spurs did... And here we've got a free kick given by the referee. Goes for goal with the header. Wonderful save to really reach out for that. Well, we've been privileged to watch two of the best goalkeepers and uh, some of the saves they've made have been outstanding. Defender to it first. Tries the through pass. And the cross is in.
Well, a real treat in store for you. Coverage on EA Sports of the Premier League fixture. Borussia Dortmund, and they'll be facing Arsenal away from home. Yeah, I've had a lot of supporters get excited about it, and I am as well. Coman, El Nene. Now Marcus Rashford. Mohamed El Nene. Our good friend Alan McAnally is watching the Tottenham game today at White Hart Lane. Alan. It's another goal for Tottenham Hotspur. It's been scored by Hoon Min Son. Yet another goal for him. A corner was played short and he took the ball to the corner of the area before calling a great shot into the far corner. 68 minutes played. 4 0. Cheers, Alan. Castro. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Good football between these two. Nice passing. Borussia Dortmund on the ball. They've worked hard to get it there. Mohamed El Neni. Good pass. Getting it forward. It's a good ball. Gonna try his luck. throw time ticking on just over 15 minutes to go well, he's threaded the pass through neatly the keeper can collect this one onto the attack now trying to thread it through here Morata! They have taken the lead here in the dying moments. Well, this place is absolutely jumping. What a finish and at what a stage in this match. Well, it's a goal and I don't think it'll be the last one they score today, the way they're playing. No, and the opposition is all over the place. Just no semblance of organisation from them. Had to wait a while to get the first goal of the game. You sensed it was coming, it's finally arrived. Dortmund in some distress here, but the supporters haven't lost the faith. Oh, just looking at the manager on the touchline, he's furious because he knows he's... Shots off! Well, in a game where it will go down to the wire, that could have really been a turning point, but he's missed the chance. He's getting some stick as well off his own fans, and you can understand why. This is how they love to play on the break. A chance in this part of the pitch. Good defending. He's got his shot off now. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. It won't be. Three minutes from the referee via the fourth official. That's the decision regarding added time. He's got his fist to it. Crisp defending there. <laughs> Referee has called a halt here. And it has finished in the end 1-0. They've held out to protect the win. The goals win them the game, but the... Defenders made it possible because they had such pressure to contend with. Yeah, and I've got to say, I thought that uh, that rear guard was absolutely tremendous, the way that they worked as a unit. They were extremely tight working for each other. It was, uh, it was great to watch.